And we're back. We're at News here at the is starting to Milestone Market. And there's something that I haven't done yet that I will do now. Because uh, I kind of forgot about it, but yeah. And it's the location of the where the gargoyle statues manifest every time you get 10. For now, I only have like 15 or something like that, so I'll only be able to open one chest. <clears throat> I believe that once you do this, once you enter this place for the first time, uh, you can fast travel in here th afterwards, so... Yeah. Um, so you can see there are like several rooms, and as you go in, <coughs> um, a door opens, and you get to open a chest, you get something, you know, depends, sometimes it's something good, Let's see what we got here, oh cool, we got a, uh, an, uh, an ammo for the dog, here you go. Scary expression. <laughs> uh, and then you push this thing that in each room you push one and you will make a, like a bridge or something that each time it'll be longer and longer till we reach that one treasure at the bottom. Uh, this is why I early uh, in the game asked people if it was worth it and many people told me that it wasn't, so... Uh, I don't know, you know, maybe it's not that good. But I'll get as many as I can, and if in the end something happens that I may be motivated and get them all, then, then I'll get them all. So you can see, you can just walk over here, but we need more of those things pressed down. Pretty cool. Um, <clears throat> I wonder if no, no. Guess I'll have to get out to fast travel. Maybe I don't know, or maybe I was in the water, so I don't know. Um, so let's continue with the side quest. Um, there is this one that it's divided in two, the evil and the good quest. These, this quest particularly affects the future a lot, so, you know, uh, depending on what you do, of what kind of character do you have, then I guess you'll choose. But here it is, Defender of the Light, which is the good one, and the Oakfield Massacre. I guess you pretty much understand what that means. <laughs> it's basically to uh, to go with the with the uh, with the bad guys, the Temple of Shadows or whatever. And you go in there and you, and you 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 know, it, it's exactly the opposite. So when we see now their plans, it's it's that you were going to carry them out, but now we're just going to be stopping them instead. But it does affect the future a lot, so... I don't know. <laughs> I think both ways is just... Not all the same, but depending on who you are is depending on what you'll do. I've done already evil, neutral, whatever. And I don't know. I just don't find that, that <clears throat> being evil is so beneficial in this game. I was kind of a little more evil on the first one, but I don't know. It wasn't really that bad. Oh, I was hoping you would return. The temple is in need of a protector once more. We have always suffered at the hands of the vile cultists from the Temple of Shadows. But I fear they're preparing a major attack against us. It would seem the Shadow Worshippers are planning to poison the holy water in the Wellspring Cave. 
If that happens, the Golden Oak will die. It would mean the end of our order, perhaps even the end of the village and all its people. You helped us once before. Will you do so again? The light blesses us with your help again. Thank you. The first thing you must do is to check the statues from which the water pours forth. Ensure they haven't been contaminated with the taint of evil. The shadow worshippers are likely to target the main chamber next, but you mustn't allow them to desecrate it. Maybe you've noticed that more money is coming... Uh, my income has increased, but it's just that I bought some businesses and stuff, so, you know, I do those things off screen, because anyways, you know how to do it. So every five minutes I get 2,000 gold, and I'll keep getting even more in the future, it's just that, for now I'm just buying big businesses instead of houses. That's where you get the bigger income, and, well, yeah. Hello. Let's go. So it's basically the same place where you went with uh, with hammer. If you were the bad guy, then you would be the one coming out of that cave and doing really bad things. I think these uh, monks should really just train themselves and become fighters instead of peacemakers. It's honestly, relying on others to save their asses is kind of stupid. I mean, I know they, they worship the light or whatever, but I don't know. I mean, these uh, people from the, the evil ones, the Shadow Temple ones, are a little more graphical. So they just come in and do whatever they want. <clears throat> or I don't know, maybe they should put up some sort of holy shield or holy barrier on this place so that nobody who's evil can come in. <laughs> I don't know. The shadow worshippers are under our protection. Which means power I banish you to the Cana. You will... guy was a little bit too easy. <laughs> oh, you're hurt. Here you go. Okay. Whoops. Punishing my dog. <laughs> I really don't get that function also, like, punish your dog, unless there's like a, uh, a positive thing about it by making him a little more responsible. And maybe he'll be, like, better if you punish him now and then, I don't know. Uh, kill him! Cornelius Grimm shall reward us well. And all oh, wow, 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 wow,
<laughs> yeah, it goes in one shot. That's kind of sad. I guess that's why he has protectors. He's not a fighter. He's just there to do some really voodoo, sh voodoo crap to the <laughs> to the holy water. You, you would cast aside our unholy alliance for some feeble monks. Nobody turns their back on the Temple of Shadows and lives. You think you can stop me? I am channeling the natural energies of the wellspring of light and feeding my unholy powers. I cannot be harmed. Slaughter him! Fighting time. Huh? I didn't realize this was once a cemetery. The fighting? Is it really over? Oh, thank you so much! The Temple of Shadows will never recover from this. We are saved! You are a holy champion, sent to us by the light itself. Thank you again. Yay, I win. I'm awesome. <laughs> So we're done with that. Let's go to, uh, let's see.
So for next time I'll be probably going to the main quest if there's nothing else to do. And uh can go to the next chapter of the game. Digging spot where? Here? Cool. Easy we got something. I thought I was up there, I was kinda nervous. Eternal love ring again. Huh. Oh well. <laughs> uh go there. So just make sure you've done all these quests and next time we'll be heading out. <coughs> Hopefully. So I'll see you guys on the next one. This has been Uzumachi. We stop here. And bye bye.